Yo, what's up guys? Today we are on this brand new old school RSPS called Neox. And before we get to this video, I'm going to give away three donation mystery boxes. To enter the giveaway, all you have to do is like the video, subscribe to my channel, comment your in-game name below, turn on the post notifications and join my personal Discord. Neox is full of content. Here's a list of some of the more popular things to do. So what do we have here? We got skilling, of course. Currently 22 of 23 trainable skills, as you can see the construction is currently unavailable, it will be added in the near future. We have plenty of minigames here, Chambers of Xeric of course, Fight Games, Infernal Paros, Castle Wars, Best Control, even Winter Dot guys, Clan Wars and more. On to the bosses, we got Corp, War Key, Card Wars, Kraken, Zulra, Tagano Kings, Caliphate Queen and more. Under the other, you can find Grand Exchange, Bank Presets, Tasks and Achievements, Daily Challenges, Pets and more. If you guys ask me what I think about this server, guys, I really love it. I personally think that this server has a huge potential to be the number one OSRS server that has ever been out there. So yeah, this is just my opinion. You guys can think what you want, but yeah, I personally really, really Love this server and I'm very excited for this release. Man, I am so excited. But you guys keep in mind, this server is still not released yet. It's still in the beta mode. But yeah, it's it looks absolutely amazing, guys. So yeah, the first thing I want to showcase you is the home area. Look at that. Look at how big this area is. You can zoom out here. You can zoom in here. You can even zoom out the minimap. Look at this cool feature. That is absolutely amazing. Even the world map is working perfectly. You can zoom out, you can zoom in. Look at that. What a lovely island. What a lovely Neox island it is. All right, let me take you on a little tour. Let's check it out. Let's check out what we can find from the home area. All right, let's dip into the shops area. Look at that. I do like the interfaces. Guys, you want to see the interfaces? All right, we have donation manager here. You click on chains and look at this interface. Bro, this is something very, very unique. So pretty much you can buy things for credits from the donation manager. Look at that. A lot of equipment, utilities, supplies and everything. Super dope. All right, now let's get to the normal shops. Look at these interfaces, guys. Look at these. You can read the introduction here, the description. And right here you have the drop down menu. You can select between armors, weapons and everything. This is something I've never ever seen before. You basically select the item you want, unlimited stock, you have the cost here, a full face helmet and everything. This is the amount you can buy, super amazing. And the same thing with the other stores as well. This is something very, very unique, I must say, yeah. And the fact this is an old school private server, this server will bring back so many memories. That is just crazy. Let me show you guys the tasks. So if you want to check out the tasks, the achievements, you click on the guest tab, you go on the red hot and here we go, view task list. This is just insane. You can read about the rewards here, 200 task points, 250K coins. Yo, the amount of tasks this server has, bro, endless amount, endless amount. And yeah, if you want to filter them, you just over over to this menu right here. Also some drop down menus here, the tier, you can select between tiers from easy to master. Then you have the types, of course. Yeah, a lot of types here. Then you have the area, you can select between Warrock, Falador and so on. Skills and of course the completion. Incomplete or complete. Yeah, this is pretty much the tasks list. I'm loving it. I am loving it. And when you scroll down, you see the list of achievements. Bro, look at that. Let me click on one of the achievements. Let's see. Oh, let's click true completionist. Complete all tasks and achievements. Obtain task points. Yeah. Yeah. Putting these tasks and achievements in numbers, there's at least 800 plus unique tasks and achievements. This actually encourages players to participate in numerous activities all throughout the world. There's a lot of tasks, a lot of achievements, guys. This server seems so complete. Like everything is so smooth, there's a lot of features, there's a lot of content, it seems so good, so good. Yeah, what is this? This is kind of some kind of a rat pitch or something. Alright, let me check out some more, let me check out some more. Yeah, this server has got a lot, this server has got a lot, so we basically have Grand Exchange here. 
you can buy things here you can do anything bro there's so many things there's that guy sigmund walking around at the home area what i will call this that's pretty much the portable shopkeeper portable shopkeeper portable general store whatever you want to call this but whenever you trade sigmund you can offer him your items he's gonna buy these for some quick sell price look at that man's just offering up some cash for these normal short power let me add these eggs and look at that man is just offering items right off the bat but yeah this is one very very cool feature i would say <laughs> nice then we have the ferox you can buy sell these emblems the wilderness emblems you also have the mage of samurak here let me actually see what this guy says welcome wanderer yes another task completed this is how easy it is we plot money yeah this is the Ferox Exchange. Nice. Nice. I do like these interfaces. These are very, very cool. And very easy to navigate, actually. Let me see if I can show you guys the fully working Rune Light plugin. Look at that. The server even has the Rune Light. They've got pretty much everything. They've got pretty much everything. All the settings here and everything. Very nice. The XP tracker. Yeah, this is how it works. This is how it works. All right, let me put my screen back on the main. If you wonder, what is this thing I'm carrying? So this is actually a resource bag. You can open it. You can close it. You can look inside of it. You can deposit items. Yes, resource bag. The bag is empty. Weight zero kilograms. Maximum is 50 kilograms. So this is actually... A unique approach to expanding inventory limitations that allows for players to store items within that can be deposited at their bank at a later time so this item can be even upgraded guys but yeah you can upgrade this thing through completing tasks and achievements of course L let me show you guys the donation mystery boxes i will be giving out first of all i will have to put your attention on this beautiful interface again guys this i just can't get it out of my mind this is a huge huge project this area is one of the biggest projects out there this is so unique look at this menu just hovering over here this is very very cool let me open up one mystery box for you guys so i can show you how it all works what are we gonna get what are we gonna get so we are pretty much getting Neox essences. All right, looks like we can convert it to dust. We can claim it. We can send it straight to the bank. All right, let's send it straight to the bank. Let's open up another one. Let's see what are we getting. Can we stop it? No, we can't stop it. So we have to watch the it hovers over this menu. Okay, looks like we're getting something good now. Yes, you can pick between regular Iron Man. You can pick the standard Iron Man, Ultimate Iron Man, and of course the Hardcore Iron Man. And then whenever you pick your game mode, you also have to pick your XP mode. Easy, medium, and hard. Now it's time to show you the game utilities. Challenges, first of all. So we have all the challenges here. Whenever you complete this challenge, you can claim your rewards. That is amazing. So these are the daily challenges, actually. We also have weekly challenges. We have monthly challenges, so there's a lot of things to do on this server. Alright, we also have trophy under the game utilities. So yeah, general crater, you can see it shows you the level and everything. These are the drops, the rarity, quantity, everything is listed here. Alright, we also have collection log, you can check all the logs here. Bosses, raids, clues, minigames even other yeah there's a bunch of things to check out on this server then we have bed collection all the pets are listed right here you can call the bed here as well unlock type boss yeah so many pets here that is just very good that is very good and then for the final thing guys frequently asked questions they even have a place for that you can click how do i travel for example it explains perfectly how to travel then how do i make money Look at that everything is in front of you yeah the teleportation so for example how do i travel forgot to show you this portal but yeah there are several ways to travel around neox the most popular being the neox portal found at the home area so like let's take a look at this teleportation interface so yeah this is the teleportation interface guys there's the cd teleports skilling teleports 
pretty much everything here. They even have the port Piscalier views. Yeah, skilling is is a very nice activity for me. I personally love skilling. Training, mini games, bosses. They have a little visual content here as well, showing you the teleport picture. All right, let's see, let's see. All right, for example, we have Sulra. Okay, we will go on cities and you can search for the teleport. Sulra, it pops up super easy. You can even put it under your favorites. Pretty nice, man. Okay, I have some more things in my inventory. So we pretty much have a Neox supply crate. These are the skilling supplies. You can select things. A Neox raw meat, a Neox herb. Let's take this one. You get 10 Neox herb. We have the medium crates as well. We have the huge crates. Look at that, 100 Neox essences. Then we have the experience lamps. Let's rob the bonus experience giant lamp so for cooking we have 13 mil xp at the moment let's use it boom and we just got 1.7 mil bonus xp that is a lot of xp there that's super dope guys and then we have the neox dust if you guys ask what we can do with the neox dust this is the dust exchange you can spend your dust here you can buy all these things for example party hats so what is the what is the price of a white party at 10 mil Neox dust? That is crazy, bro. That is crazy. Donation Mr. Box, we're giving away 3,000 Neox dust only. Slayer VIP ticket 7.5k. And you can buy these beautiful Neox supply crates. The huge one costs 18,000 Neox dust only, not that much. The bonus XP lamp, 8,000. So compared to the party ads, this is just a piece of cake. Yeah. That is insanely nice. And of, of course, the drop down menu here showing to mystery boxes, skilling supplies, bonus XP lamps, and rares. Yo, here's the Taskmaster. Claim rewards. You can claim all the rewards from this one. Nice close of silence and 15,000 cash. That is dope. Let me check the shop. Yeah, guys, this is the achievement reward shop. You can claim all the rewards here. That is very nice. Let's check the drop down menu, accessories, equipment, weapons, and everything. Let's check the weapons. Yo, but yeah, first you have to complete the achievement and afterwards you can claim these things. Another thing I wanted to show you guys, so this is the Neox blog, pretty much the home page. Right here you can check out all the updates. Let me show you, these are all the updates. They may be working very, very hard on this server, the owners and the developers. Big shout out to these guys, they've put thousands of hours in this server and they're still working their asses off which is good news because i am looking forward for this server release let me show you the knowledge base as well guys look at that knowledge base wild essence there's a lot of visual content here wild essence faq uh let me check something else uh content creation we have the neox ranks wilderness emblems yo this is the one thing i wanted to tell you about so this server actually has a very nice wilderness emblem system can see wilderness emblem activation emblem perks emblem leveling selling a wilderness emblem so yeah guys if you're planning on working on emblems you can just jump through this little topic here it explains everything deeply and you can find the most valuable information here about emblems quest guides dust and change neox supply crates we have rules and guidelines, player support, player commands. If you guys want to join the community, the first thing you want to do is join their Discord. Neox actually has a very, very well built Discord. Take a look at that. Announcements tab. All the announcements are listed here. Owners are posting things here. Admins, community managers. Yes. Also, developer updates. All the updates are listed here. Take a look at this amount of updates. A lot of updates right here community events social media feed discord guidelines official landing creator applications bro that's dope that is dope general discussion of course you can talk to other players here media sharing if you want to apply for a beta tester spot head over to this section and apply for this spot knowledge base questions and answers technical issues general feedback billing support report a player can pretty much find everything from neox discord and of course buying items selling items the outpost 
Nice. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to wrap up this video. What can I say? I will have to repeat myself again. Looking at all the features, content and community, I can easily say that this server has the potential to be the best ever old school RuneScape private server out there. But yeah, join Neox Discord, check out their forums, join beta testing and become a Nexonian. Thank you for watching guys, peace.